So we got our results back from Caitlin's test finally. They mailed them to us. Um, her official blood sugar reading from the blood draw was... Oh, I'm weird like you, I know it's true. I'm in the clouds up there with you. You think you're flawed, but wouldn't you agree? You're perfect for me. What is daddy doing out there? <laughs> huh? Let's go inside. <laughs> what you got? Cat. I can't believe she let you hold her like that. She's so cute. Say hi, Chloe. <laughs> so we got this cookbook from McKenna's doctor. The Disney, dishing it up Disney style. And we decided to try a recipe from it tonight. So we got Cogsworth oven fried fish and chips. What's the verdict? Did you like it? It's pretty sweet. It's pretty sweet? And it's crunchy. Mm-hmm. Kind of really likes her fish sticks. What about you, Katie? What's the verdict? I like the fries. You like the chips. <laughs> These aren't chips, they're french fries. Yeah, but when you have them with fish, they're called fish and chips. It's okay. fish and french fries. Mm hmm. Um, so Katie likes the chips and Kenna only likes the fish. I only take like little pieces of it because mm -hmm. I can't take a big bite because it's too a little bit too hard. Mm, yeah. So fish and chips was a winner? Uh huh. Good job, Daddy. <laughs> Daddy got the jets to work? Yeah! Woo Can I show my butt to the camera? No! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna stay in the water for a long time. Ready? Okay, one, ready. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, go! The water is very warm here. Good. Yeah, and then the water is so warm. I see you make a butt. I also wanted to give you guys an update. So we got our results back from Caitlin's test finally. They mailed them to us. Um, her official blood sugar reading from the blood draw was 6.1. So, essentially, if you remember in my last video, which I'll tag somewhere up here, um, anything between 4.5 and 5.6 is considered a non-diabetic. Anything from 5.6 to 6.5 is what's considered pre-diabetes. So, that is where she falls. She's in what they consider pre-diabetes or someone who is um, more likely to develop diabetes, but she's not clinically diagnosable with diabetes. So essentially, um, the doctor has said we just have to watch her and make sure that she doesn't exhibit any of the other symptoms of a diabetic. So frequent urination, thirsty all the time, uh, blurry vision, fatigue, that kind of stuff. We can also keep testing her blood sugar, which we might um, if she lets us, but we're not going to go overboard on it. So that is where we are. Just wanted to give you an update. Ooh, look who I found. Hi, kitty. Did you decide to join us tonight? Hi, kitty, kitty, kitty. Oh, man. <laughs> hey, Chewy, 
Calm down. So you're going into your endocrinology appointment. Hi. What's your BG? Hi. What is it? Two. 